Hello everyone and welcome back to my Let's Play Dwarf Fortress Masterwork Mod We have some dwarves We finally got a dwarf caravan inside and at the Trade Depot Don't know how long it's been since we've had something like that But with them, an ambush! Curse them! It looks like five though it Means there's probably more ambushes Probably many more but, let's go kill these. Kill rectangle. Is that all of them? Yep. And give the order. They'll be pushing and shoving to get out there to kill them. Hopefully we'll get some trading going on. Sign. Life goods. Yes. We are trading some stuff. Uh, trade requested. And resume. Hopefully nobody dies to the ambush. The humans are just now leaving, so they might run into them. Or be a decoy? Who knows? Or kill them all. What in the world was that noise? Slashes him, jumps away, yells something. Having trouble breathing? Maybe that was it? A left hand. I mean, that's the only thing I see. Wow, look at the range on those guys. Somebody's fighting in water, and now they're getting slacked to pieces. Lumberjack is fighting. He got bruised. That's probably something else. Lacerates him in the head, so right away. Just whoosh, off of his head. One dodges and jabs him. Another one slices him in the left thigh. Uh, another one cleaves him in the left arm. That's pretty quick. Squads, A, why don't you just move like right here? Squad. Squad. D, why don't you move to like right here since you have that awesome range? Squad B, you're going to probably move closer to down here. Um, did I put anyone on? No, they're not hiding. And we've got some temporary walls going up. I've realized that I can't quite disassemble this building right now. Because it's still full of pennies. If I do that, the pennies will explode all over the place and probably cause quite a bit of lag. Um, we're not interested in taking you a lot. See? Oh, he blocked one. Why is he not dead yet? Strike him, train the muscle, train the gut, sensory nerves, strike some right 
chin. And the left buttocks. His left buttocks gets along ground, bruising the muscle. Strikes him in the chest, tearing the muscle. In the right buttocks. Murder nerve's been severed in the left arm. Bullets are hitting him. Right arm in the left buttocks. And he's pretty much going to die. But we already knew that. It is a lot of practice though. Can't believe he's still alive. Are the gun doors okay? They can't see him from there. Okay, um... Okay, he's going to go stab him a little bit. There you go. He must have ran out of ammo. So then he decided to... Yeah. Stab him in the head with the bayonet. Tearing apart the muscle and shattering the neck's bone. Ligament's been torn, tendon's been torn. Lodged firmly in the wound. So he decided to twist around. Stabs him in the something. Looks like in the head. Shattering the skull. Tearing apart the outer brain. Artery's been opened. Tendon's been... Tendon, the skull's been torn. Thief looks even more sick. Javelin stroke. The javelin throw has lodged firmly in the wound. And it looks like he's dead. So. Guess that works. Let's resume all the constructions that got. Messed up. 41 buildings. And I guess I will be back once it's time to trade if it's not already. Not yet. He's requested. Should be soon. So I'll be back shortly. And we have another ambush or something. But there's also a frost giant here. I'm confused now. Um, announcements. It just says ambush. Um, later. Unless the frost giant is leading them, that's possible happens sometimes. The frost giant is not going to like being shot to death there. Kill them all. Another ambush? And they kill each other of course. So apparently, let's see, who is the Frost Giant actually fighting? Frost Giant Spearman, he is caught in a burst of warlock blood. He's attacking the human, it looks like. But he's caught in a burst of swirling dark. Caught in a burst of lightning. Caught in a burst of swirling dark. Caught in acid cloud, swirling dark, and lightning. And he's still attacking the human. Maybe you should be attacking someone else? I hope my guys have ammo, because that's the only way to deal with these types of guys. And I hope my trader is going to be here soon. No job. Why? Let me see. Uh, if we... Uh, 
Maybe I have him stuck here. Search for Chiefy. Maybe that was causing some problems with him trying to do something like drink or eat or something like that. Toggle that. Yeah, he's starving. That's probably the problem. It is taking you that long to kill a freaking horse? Are you going to run away now or are you still coming? We've got ammo! Squad A... No, Squad B. To make sure you don't get too close. Isn't that... Just want to make sure we get rid of all of the... Warlocks first. Because they are nasty. Hmm, something seems to be slowing down the computer, and I'm not sure what it is. Six buildings resumed. We're getting there. Ah, oh, I bet it's that ammo. DB claim. Ammo is blocking the wall. How is that frost giant, by the way? Wounds... He's not hurt at all, really? Okay. That's bad. If he can survive that kind of stuff. None of these are hurt either. Well, one of them is. Hmm, maybe we should get everyone inside. Yes, that's probably a good idea. I should also... W... Um, no, we'll leave it like this for now. No trading. That should be okay. I don't know why there's so many people out here, though. Okay, so who's going to be the first one to die? I really hope we have ammo. It looks like guys are rearming and coming back, but we're still missing one of our elite guys. And that guy's going to do something. Not the time to be taking a break. I think he just set himself on fire. Let's see. Crossbow Dwarf is fighting. The flying green bolt strikes him in the left thigh, breaking away the blood, fracturing the bone. Murdery nerves been severed. Tendons have been torn. Strikes him in the chest, tearing the muscle and tearing the left breast muscle through the cloak. The witch spearman is propelled away by the force of the blow. That is... this one? Looks like it's two different guys. Caught in the cloud of warlock blood, warlock blood, warlock blood. And this is the other one. Also caught in a cloud of warlock blood and warlock blood. Um, oh right, they go invisible. There's still two right here, right here. There's some kind of glitch with the graphics. Oh, uh, there goes the sound. Let's try to get that back so that we can actually tell what's going on without having to read the text. Um, okay, so you have one there who's really 
hurt. One there who's kind of hurt. One there who's not very hurt. And one here who is kind of hurt. This guy is stunned. Why aren't the other guys shooting him? Ah, the force of the blow is propelling them away. And it, is there another ambush? No, that's a snatcher, okay. Naturally, sound sense doesn't want to work today. Okay, you're chasing that guy. I think you might have just killed him or you hurt him bad. Um, Sorcerer Spearman. Okay, they are getting shot by bullets now. In the hand. Fracturing the bone. And the left wrist bone. Uh, fracturing the bone. Sensory nerves been severed. In the spearman, fracturing the bone. Arteries been opened. Okay. Okay, there's both, both of our elite guys. Beast is not an explosion of guts. Um, um, sounds like the right, is completely broken. Turn sound. Okay, so that means that squad uh, B, you are up. Go kill us a frog giant. Go. Did I get the order? Squad B, I gave the order. Why aren't you moving? Um, there goes that. And now, more acid, frost chat? Or, no, the other guys. Where are you going? Is that my guy? Mace Dwarf, Midnock, I think he's one of mine. Isn't he? Yes, he's one of mine. And he's hurt pretty bad. He's going to need major surgery. I think he is riding. Not yet. We'll probably have to give him the fountain healing. Um, it's hard to tell what's going on. Rifle dwarf called in swirling dark, swirling dark. Uh, so it's blocked. He misses him. He misses him. Rifle door is racked with pain. And we must just be out of ammo. Let's get squads A and D to move up a bit. Where's my cursor? Maybe they can help out. Okay, somebody should be attacking this guy. Hammer of Strikes and misses the Frost Giant. Something strikes the Hammerdorf in the right thigh, fracturing the bone. Frost Giant checks and misses blocked. Hammerdorf Giant. Frost Giant blocks the seal bullet. Okay. Let's try sound again. Someone's become an elite crossbowman. Not sure if that's a new one or not. You can check. Yes, we now have three elite crossbow dwarfs. Okay, there's some better sound. Frost Giant Spearman has lost hold of his staff. And in the right hand, 
tearing apart the muscle. And the breast, tearing apart the muscle and left breast muscle. From behind, in the left hand, no, punch with the hard left hand. And the attack glances away. Use your big axe. Undercut swing in the chest, tearing apart the muscle, tearing apart the right lung. Arteries has been open in the attack. Having trouble breathing, having trouble breathing, having more trouble breathing, it says. Um, another one is going around. Cleaves him in the right shin. And the severed part sails off in an arc. So that guy's probably going to die here soon. Like right about now. Okay, I guess that works. Then we're going to go military alert, get everyone back there. Um, we're going to do squad A, B, and D. You are going to move to here. And, oh crap, there's still one alive. Well, not for long. That didn't take much. Somebody needs medical attention. I'm hoping that they'll go provide it now. Uh, I really don't care about that. And we'll probably have to resume all yet again. Yep. Whew. That was messy. Now what should we do? Doors have spin a construction wall. Of course, it's the ones there. Can you not move the bolts on your own or something? Do we have to dump them? Maybe that'll deal with it. Uh, once that gets done, we should be mostly okay. As long as we don't lose some guys. He's pretty bad off. See status, health, ability to stand lost. Can't see the details until he's get diagnosed. He doesn't know that his leg is broken until someone tells him. He just knows he can't stand. Um, another snatcher. Where is he? Oh, he's way down here. How did he get in? He's going to die. How did he get in? Shouldn't have been away. I mean, we have pets guarding here. Had pets until they started chasing the snatcher. Oh, that's a bad place for you to go. Oh, he survived it. Well, he's still going the wrong way. Okay, um, I guess I will be back. If I can find... Okay, I think we can trade now. Let's see what they brought us. Pig iron, iron, pig iron. We don't need the blood steel. I think we can use the aluminum to convert to higher value stuff. Rolling glass is cheap enough to buy it. We want to buy a fair amount since it's been so long since they haven't been here. But hopefully they brought something that's actually worth ha having. Uh, Fireland mine, that could be useful. Don't need the horses or the cows. Um, really didn't bring very much. Sling. Wooden trading sword, fungi sword, shell plate padded 
something, another ancient shell plate, copper buckler. Did you not even bring any like Cloth stuff, some dice, dip cup, shadow leaf, bitter root, plump helmet die, plump helmet die. Oh, we'll take the sandbags, ooh, chips and plaster we need. Especially with as many people that are in the hospital right now. More sand. More dyes and sand. Um, none of that is anything we want. Uh, I guess I could melt, melt down the mithril emeralds. I really do not need meat. I don't know why you keep bringing it. I have hundreds. Uh, we will take the berries and such. Even though we may not need them. And the thread, of course. But not that. Backpacks, cheeses. Hmm. A mithril wagon? A whole wagon? Really? That should be worth something. If we melt it down. Unless it is a toy mithril wagon. But I think we have toys disabled. Is that really all you brought? Take those and melt them down. Bourbon wine. Titanium. Take that and melt it down. Take that and melt it down. Um, actually just Q myth. Mithril bolas. Those are pretty expensive, but we'll take them just so that we have the trade value. What about titanium? Titanium boot. Um, some empty bins. Like that's cute. There we go. Why is that purple? Ah, uh, must be an artifact. That's what it is. Do we have an artifact bin? I haven't looked at the bins in a while. Why are these purple? Oh, maybe we stole them or something? I don't understand why they're purple. We haven't stole them. We made those, we know. Unless it thinks we stole them. It could be that those are things that we traded away and then they died and we've taken them back. That's possible. So what we'll do is we'll unselect all the loose, all the purple stuff. Actually, yeah, we'll do that. I don't want to risk it on this trade because we kind of need this one to complete. We'll try to sell it to the elves or something. Or maybe we'll try to sell it right after we trade the real trade. Yeah, that should be all of that. All this earthenware. We must have 
quite a lot of that stuff. A lot of that too. Uh, how, how far are we? We'll go like 12, I think. That should make them really happy. Then we're going to try to trade these for just something useless. Like some clay. Or, well, something that we could at least kind of use. Um, a cage, I guess. Pen, copper, zinc. Trader profit, yeah. Try that. So they took them without any kind of complaining. So I have no idea why they're purple. I do not know what that means. Yeah, just no clue. Uh, you can go back to doing whatever it is you were doing. And I'm going to, I guess, set up another penny route. And I can probably get close to moving those guys inside. Just have to mine out this last little bit. And then everyone can get inside the walls. Well, we have to mine out this bit too. Wait, wait. Grizzly bear. A grizzly bear. Well, something to eat. How much meat do we have? Like, tons? And tons. Okay, so I will be back shortly. Actually, let me check the time on this. We are pretty much out of time for today, but we want to do one more thing. We're going to... Go to the alternative start screen. And search for bolts. And we want to show the forbidden ones. These are going to be the individual things. Things that have been fired and all that kind of crap. So then we're going to select all of them by Shift A. And dump them all and unforbid them. Then we'll do bullets. Fit in to the same thing. Dump, forbid, and jab ones. Yeah, those are forbidden for some reason. Um, dump and forbid. And what we'll do is we will melt these down. Are those? Oops. That wasn't right. Forbidden javelins. And I've messed that up. Um, well, I guess we'll do the foreign made ones. So we will dump those. That should help. Should get most of them. The Unforbidden will, I guess, round up the rest. And by melting them down, we will get metal and also reduce the amount of objects that are in the game. And hopefully that will help with the frame rate a little bit. We also want to claim all the stuff that's over here. DB. I forbode it when there was a bad guy hanging out here. But... It is no longer thou shalt not. It is thou shalt. And I'm trying to get the pennies done. It's going to take a while. We might could go ahead and get that set up next episode. Maybe, maybe not. Depends on how far our miners get by then. Actually, they're almost done. So, we'll probably maybe work on that. Possibly. There's a few things I also want to work on. Do want to design the how we're going to do the defenses? Which just 
notice I have a stairway there. Don't need that. Probably think that there for just construction reasons. And we're going to want to start to build a road as well. That's right. Right, so this is going to be the end of this episode. Like if you like, subscribe if you're not. Thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.